We've got a pop-up that's sticking up several inches too high. The top of that pop-up should be even with the ground, so let's fix that. Our crew begins by digging out around the head. This is a 12 inch head on a flexible swing joint. The fact that this is on a swing joint makes the process a bit easier. 12 inch pop-up heads often have inlets on the bottom and the side. Right now the swing joint is connected to the bottom inlet. Our crew member is removing the pop-up head to make it easier to dig. To make it easier to place the head at the right height, we will be attaching the swing joint to the side inlet. There's a plug in the side inlet. Unscrew that plug and use it to plug up the bottom inlet. Now we're ready to reattach the sprinkler head. We've got the bottom of the head flush with the top of the soil. As you'll notice, the head is 6 to 8 inches from the foundation of the house. That's an appropriate distance. Now, backfill the hole. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything for your irrigation needs, so your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens are lush and beautiful. And if you have any questions about our products, chat with one of our amazing customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really know their stuff, and they will get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. I'm Dwayne Smith for Sprinkler Warehouse. Professional quality, rock bottom prices.